What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another thing on the internet. Let me take this guy. This guy's real good. That's weird. And then he accidentally misclicked and did not take the uh, 10 ticket rare. Oof. Yeah, it's going to go right here. Boop! 10 tickets, and it's also very, very good. Oh, super tired means tired at work. What did you say to me? What did you just say to me? I said 10 what tickets. did you just say? I said 10 tickets. Say it to my face. I said 10 tickets and it's also really good. Is it rat or is it guild mage? I think it's guild mage. There's also two very good white cards in this pack if we want to go Abzan. But there's no reason to do nah, that. Oh boy. Frank, because of you, I've started calling my butcher Meaty Mike and he's so confused. His name is Mike, by the way. Well, that actually works out perfect. I think that's significantly less. I would never take a guild gate over any of these playables. In two color decks, you barely need guild gates. Um, you don't really need them. And they're all. super easy to come by. Like, you really don't have to. Uh... Oh, man. Streamlabs, you went crazy. Hold on, let me actually edit that real quick. That's correct, but there is a, a thing. All right, so. All right. I'm just going to take the guild mage here. Nope, not there. Well, we got a hexy boy. I don't care about that thing at all. Really? Yeah, this guy doesn't have trample. Cost nine mana. Why did mm -hmm. I think it had trample? I don't know why you thought that. I mean, it doesn't really cost nine mana. Oh, that dude cost nine mana, bro. No, he probably cost more like seven or six. It's still a lot. Giveaway settings. Uh, start giveaway. Hmm, interesting. Okay, okay, hold on. I'm trying to figure out how to... Oh, I think this is it. Delete that. Edit you. I don't know what to take here, so I'm just gonna take this gargoyle, I guess. Gargoyle? That could be good. <clears throat> oh, an artful takedown, eh? I like Sultai a lot better than Abzan, but yeah, Lifelink dude was fine too, but There's also uh, Molderhog who reads uncastable. Really? This guy's great. What are you talking about? I think it's pretty hard to cast. You just Really? I don't think so, man. You regularly have like four creatures in your graveyard. It costs five mana for a six six, get a free land. I think you're I think you're woefully underskilled in this draft format, my friend. Well then take it. Well, I think the artful takedown is better. I'm just defending that this is a playable card. You alright, man? Hmm? Yeah, I'm fine. Alright. You're just rubbing your eyes. You're just rubbing my eyes. Alright. Let me rub my eyes, man. I'm not stopping you, man. I think you're trying to. I think I would have been a little more aggressive about it. If I was You're gonna to... stab my hand next time I try it, aren't you? Yeah, maybe. Oh, well, no, no blue cards here, so I feel okay about this. I'll Mike, are this. you sad about no pot pie or chicken? No, I think I'm good. He's always sad about no pot pie or chicken. Well, that was a quick pick, man. Yeah, there's nothing else in that pack. Just like this one. I mean, yeah, these fair. are pretty, pretty easy picks. <clears throat> Oh, Burgle Rat or Reach Boy? I don't. This this card's terrible. This card's great. So I wouldn't say it's terrible. It's pretty unplayable. You might board it in, maybe. It blocks things. Yeah, that's what I want to do. I, I just want to block things. That's how you win drafts. You block a lot. Mm. So what you're saying is you don't want to prevent damage. You, you need deal you, damage. You buying a tequila? No. 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 Didn't. It's good. We had a we had a deal. Would you rather have pot pie or chicken? Wow, isn't that the same thing? No, it, there's commas. Oh, <laughs> wait, where is the? Matthew, you don't have to tag me in every single, in every single thing. 
Also, I don't know why that's... What does that mean to me? What does that mean to me? I don't understand why... I, I don't understand what you're tagging me in that for. He just wants you to know, man. Thunair, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back, buddy. Really appreciate it. Nay, don't bother me. I just don't understand it. Like, don't, don't, don't confuse my, don't mistake my my confusion for, for bother. Like, it doesn't make doesn't bother me. I just don't understand it. One tequila honesty buck. Well, that's, that's what you get in here. All right, I'll get the one dollar tequila. Well, you can put your own money toward it because you're going to drink it. That's an option. No, man. The $1 tequila. Okay. I don't think it exists. It tastes like rat poison because that's, it is rat poison. That's. I think even rat poison is more than a dollar. Oh, a Dawn of Hope. Ooh, that's a good one. Is more it? like a Dawn of Schmope? No. That's... There's, what about the Fine Broker? Doing some react videos on the in the in, the, in Ravnica. <laughs> I'm from Mexico. I was wondering if there's any kind of shipping service to allow you to send you guys real tequila. Um, I man, I don't know actually. That's interesting. Does it have a worm at the bottom? <laughs> I think it's funny the way you say. Does it have a worm at the bottom? I don't like this because we're going to have to be adding a bunch of white mana. So I'm just going to take the fine broker. And then we're yeah, going gonna... to... I don't think the card is that good. In limited? It pretty much takes over games. Like, if you get to turn eight, you can make two guys a turn. That's You're not going to beat that. I'll just take the Ochre Assassin, I guess. I like this guy a lot, but I don't know if it's splashable yet. Oh, there you go. Now we're talking. And another one. Hopefully that rat comes back. Also... Also, no tequila has has no worm. No tequila has mezcal has the worm. I think. Why don't you let Why don't you let the the actual person from Mexico respond? God, you think you know everything, don't you? You smug dude, you pernicious smug dude. It wasn't your finest work, wasn't it? Though, no. Was it? No. I think it was. No. Maybe. Think about it. Oh my God! The triple fine broker deck. Okay. This is how we do it. Yeah, you will be sorry for contributing anything. Fine broker does make Molder Hulk harder to cast. Which is the one downside. But no, I, I mean, you just get dead it. weights out of your graveyard. Stop worrying about creatures. You ain't got no dead weights. You're dead weight. Wow. Got him. Rude. I got him. There's a lot of creatures. Our deck is pretty heavy creatures right now. Oh, crushing Kenopi. Why does he say Kenopi every time? Man? You gonna main deck that bad boy? This card is pretty main deckable in this format. I'll take the imp. Mm, this card's fine. Everybody floats. Bet you wish you had some guild gates now? Wait, no, why would I I still don't know why I wish I had guild gates now. <laughs> I still this is the only card that even needs a guild gate, and I could just put it over there because I could care less about it. <clears throat> I still don't understand why I'd want to have guild gates in my two color deck. Did you just sing some R.E.M. Everybody Hurts? Yeah, but... Was it a cry for help? But it was... It was different, though. Oh, because Gates. I didn't even think about it. That's a good point. Nailed it. What did you say to me? What did you say to me? That was good. 
How many how many port colors have we got? Three port colors vines in the sideboard? Man. Can't wait to board those bad boys in. I will. Oh, Sacred Foundry. That's a whole stropany. Silly human, you think you can move the card. Oh, you finally figured it out. Yeah, but I shouldn't have to do all that. Oh, he figured it out. Oh, well, this is literally a blank for I'm us. Literally probably just taking the Sacred Foundry just to have an extra dual land, but... It's not looking good, boys. Oh. It's a dollar. Whatever, I'll take the dollar. Ooh, a district guide and another okra assassin. Mm, I think it's district guide. Yeah, it seems better. Everybody hurts. Some mics. Ooh, I like this. This actually seems good in this deck because we have a lot of uh, little goldies. <laughs> Did that get you? Yeah, because it's so freaking random. We got a lot of little goldies. Look at our little goldies. Oh, I like the dead weight though. It's probably taking dead weight, especially because we have assassins, or not assassins, but fine brokers. You don't like our little goldies? There are a lot of tequila with worms, but those are not as real as Frank said. Mescal is the real. Oh no, I didn't say that. Uh, pernicious dude said that. And they're not real. And what does that mean? Like you can't eat the worm at the bottom of tequila? Yeah. It means you put the lime in the coconut and then you drink the bowl up. Okay. Hmm. Whatever. I'm just taking this. I don't need any more two drops. Look at this foil conclave cavalier. Okay. Look at it, I said. I did. No, it's okay. I'll just never talk again. No, you won't. You will. You'll just keep talking. Don't don't tease. We need one cut, Mike. What's our cut? Probably imp. Okay, well, now you're dead to me. Really? A 1-1 one -one flyer? If you don't play because it it's 1-1 one -one flyer. You play because it it's a thought seize. Yeah, but like, how many spells is it really going to have? It's any card. It's a oh, thought it's seize, card? not a duress. Oh. It's still a lot of work. What, casting it and then paying two mana is a lot of work? <laughs> I also thought it was three mana to activate for some reason. Oh, wow. So you literally have no idea what this card does and you suggested <laughs> we cut it. Seems good. I just see a 1-1 one -one flyer for one that I dislike. Even if it has a wall of text? Yeah. Interesting. I'll take another Mulder Hulk. Now we need two cuts. See what you did? Now you drink them, you drink the bowl up. Everybody knows that. I'm sad we didn't get Eternal Witness or Big Hoofs. So we do have actually three Eternal Witnesses here. So even your, even your meme, Zoro, is uh, slightly incorrect. I'm just going to have five Child of Knights in the I mean, sideboard. Those technically aren't Eternal Witnesses. You can't get spells back. I mean, sources and instants and what. Non permanent is what I'm trying to say here. God, it's so hard to talk. Look at this. Literal, literal four child of night play set in our deck. Whoa, 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 sweet child of night. And we have five portcullises. So, I mean, we're pretty good against the, um, the Boros, the aggressive Boros decks, I think. It's actually pretty relevant. I agree with you. I don't like Golgari Raiders, but this might be a deck where it's good when we have 22 creatures. Is it the hasty one? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I need two cuts? That's so many. Probably Wild Saratok. I don't think he really does oh. anything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <sighs> hmm. What is Hired Poisoner? Is just a 1-1 one -one Death Touch, right? Yeah. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Did anyone else see plus one Mitch Bucks? I don't... I, I did not see that. Did someone else see that?
You received one. I'll make it say Mitch Bucks in the chat, though. Yeah, Centipede's probably pretty meh. Now we oh, got eight centipedes more. Centipedes are gross. Centipedes are real weird. No gates in this deck seems rough? No, this this is fine. Ain't you nobody... guys never played a two-color draft deck? You don't really need dual lands. It's not a big deal. It's not. He's right. Ooh. You do, however, need more than one land. I'm going to ship this bad boy. Oh, no. Man. Per perfect hand. I'm going to put that on the bottom. I'd rather have my own things than deal with one of theirs. You're so disciplined today. Can't believe you didn't keep that. The trophy or the hand? The hand. Really? Mm-hmm. Why? Because I feel like that was one you might have snapped off. Really? It had one land. Yeah, but you're a fan of those one land hope to get their hands. That There was nothing to get. There was nowhere to go to get. <laughs> like, if I had a bunch of two drops in my hand and one land, I'd keep it. But, like, that hand didn't have anywhere to go. It had, you like, a, three an drops, eight drop. I, two lands? I don't think so, dude. Oh, this is, like, the perfect start. Let's get another greenles. Centipedes fill a useful role in the ecosystem. What what are they? What is it? Is it to be nightmare fuel? Well, you're nightmare fuel. Wow. Yeah, got him. I won't block your 2-3 because that feels bad. Oh, another another dirtle man. I'm your dirtle man, your dirtle man. Oh, you would have been good. Where were you last turn? I guess we'll just pass here. So they got land, pump this guy, attack with both these guys. Seems like a good play. Well, Stop these, attacking. These guys are trying to buy you a bottle of, you know, stuff. Hold on. <coughs> oh, okay. We had a good time. All right. So we're definitely bringing in all of our Child of Knights, I guess. I have a pump spell, you see. Um, you know, oh, look, he, he did. He had a pump spell. And another two guys. This is nice. And I think we I think we have a Vapors maybe we can bring in. I don't feel good about this situation, though. We're going to go to the next game. And assume it goes better than this. Alright, bring in the Vapors. Probably take, take out the Canopy. This guy. This guy. Actually, you're probably fine. Bring in the vines. Oh, the portcullis vines or whatever. Come on, swamp off the tippity top. You ready? Ready. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, stop playing this guy. Nailed it. Wow. We're very good at this game. Mono Blue Tempo has been popular for a while in uh, Standard. 
We got the vapors. Sometimes you just hit that uh that thing off the top, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? No. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? No. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? No. Do you? No. Don't you? Hey, look, a thing we can kill. You're a thing we can kill. Swamp. Thank you. If it's a thing, we can kill it. We got Charlie, Charlie Gag and Josh trying to buy you some tequila right now. I was planning on doing a commander stream later, so. Oh, you were? What if we did that? Drunk commander? You want to do some tequila oh, I'm, commander? I'm in for that, boy. <laughs> Oh, man. Good stuff. Okay, that guy's obnoxious. Okay, that's enough. That is enough. I really want to just play a fine broker here, but it's probably just the best we can do. Whatever. I hate that. I am un I am not thrilled with that, but it is what it is. Huh. Spicy Jalapeno three has asked you a question. Would you what would you rather receive? A place out of Big Dad Tefts or a lifetime supply of blueberry and Frankenberry cereal? Um, probably the lifetime supply of cereal. I mean, I'm not even a huge fan of those cereals, but they're good enough that like a lifetime supply is probably worth more than one set of Tefts. Are you really away me undies? What are you saying right now? You're going to have to, can you phrase your question in the form of a question? Well, it wasn't a form of a question. He just missing some words, I think. Then it was not the form of a question. Oh, yeah. There you go. Play all the little dirt burgles. Come at me, bro. Giving away? Yes, I'm giving it away. That is correct. Winner, I will fill out a form. I will, I will send you a form, a form to the winner. And, uh... You guys can do a thing with the thing. Oh, yeah. Uh, you can go in the graveyard. And you can stay on top forever. That's all I can do. Just make the big bigger. That's what I always say. Make the big bigger. How many times do you say that usually? It's like 14 times a day, I think. You okay? Yeah. Felt like you got a sniff going on. I did have a sniff going on, but How's I fixed that it. Out for you? I fixed my sniff. Fix my sniff. Oh yeah. It's awkward. You doing okay? Never. That's sad. I'm trying to find where the thing is. Hold on. Mashboard. Oh, something magical happened. Green Rays, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Come on. Oh, we know what we know what it's gonna be actually. So that's pretty good. Um I would very much like it if you blocked with all your creatures. Block with these two. He ain't blocking, man. They probably aren't blocking. Will fetch lands ever be printed with chalks and standard? It's unlikely. Yeah, I don't think they want fetch and chalks together. I could see them redoing fetch lands again, but just not in the same time frame. You guys know how good recurring grave diggers are in standard? They're better when they're three fours. 
Elk Tears, what's going on, buddy? Always good to see you. Always. Hungry Howie's Pizza is the pizza for you and me. He's right. Hungry Howie's Pizza is the pizza for you and me. I'll sub for the slightest possibility of Drunk Commander. All right. So after, I'm going to do a couple drafts too, I think. And then after that, we'll go uh, get some food and get some tequila for you guys. And uh, if you guys have tequila recommendations, we're going to a place called Lucan's Liquor. So if you guys go to that website, you can figure out what they have. And if you guys have any recommendations, let us know and we'll pick that up. And then we'll do some some sweet Atraxa Commander later. Atraxa? That's right. That's, that's one of my faves. Oh, see, then you're in good shape. That is the right... I have to assume that's the right place, yes. Yeah, that's the right one. Yep. Do, 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 do. We can just get you back. I guess we're just going to play this. I feel like we're pretty far ahead here, so we can just get the dead weight back. I recommend Senior Mike B's $1 Tequila. <laughs> oh, that is a classic. All I know is Espalon is delicious. Also, hi, Frank, and also, hi, Mike. Your color coordination is top tier. What's that? I'm just we're just black shirts, just black shirts on. Congrats got, on the fire and I got stuff on it. Morgan, it's it's been an uphill battle. There's definitely been a few instances of people just donating between twelve and twenty five subs at given points. So um, it has not been it has not been a an easy an easy trek, but it's been we're still there, which is which I'm grateful for. So this one, what's this one? Let's find out. Grand Center Cent Centenario Eneo Tequila. Hmm. Hmm. Is this the one you showed us last time? This I looks like so. the same one. Which is good because it's consistent. I just want to kill this actually so I can just keep attacking for a million. I just got an advertisement for Google and getting close to a restaurant. And that's kind of annoying because they didn't even offer a coupon or anything. And you click the notification, just Google's the restaurant, and that's it. Well, that's, that's like, yeah, I don't understand why you tagged me in that. That's funny. Matthew Orr, you have it so hard, buddy. I'm so sorry about your, your restaurant trials and tribulations. Trials and tribs. TNTs. Trials and tribs. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is aggressive. This is aggressive, and not like in a good way. Trials and trips of our days. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We actually just kill you. We can just four, five, six. We can just take this all and just kill you. Yeah, we'll do that. I want trials and tribs of me. That's why I said congrats. Okay, take it easy. Just take it easy. What is this? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. All right. Half a bottle buck. 16.5 half a bottle bucks. Josh, appreciate it, buddy. So now you're dead. All right, this is a weird attack, but I guess sometimes you just give in. Well, there's nowhere to stack it right. Um, there's they 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 could they could only do one mentor ever. This is the only guy that has more toughness than the other guys. So And po by toughness, I mean power. Just want to say I'm a long time fan, but a fan of yours since Magic Origins. Start review with Ali. Keep with the awesome work and Mike. Keep with the aggressive eye itching. <laughs> oh, man. What happened? What happened with me hating my fans? What are you talking about? What's going on? What's happening right now? I almost want 
Pax favor. I think Pax favor is actually probably pretty good against them. Michael's in charge of our... So salty. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. I finally ate a real taco here on my business trip in Spain. It's great. Great, I say. Also, I'm really wondering if you're just trolling us, if it's just this long troll about, like... Tacos? Yeah, about, like, Mexican food. Like, I've never had this Mexican food. It's so weird. And, like, little by little, you'll kind of trickle in these... Oh, I tried I tried a, a quesadilla recently. It was amazing. And then it's kind of funny. I can't tell. I'm really wondering now. Here's some of my favorite tequilas. Enjoy Fortale For Fortaleza Blanco, Siembra Azul Vals Blanco, Tequila Ocho La Maguiera, uh, Fuente Seca Extra Aneo, Grand Patron Platinum. This is a lot of tequilas. They are all pretty hard to find, so if you see one at your shop, I would go for it. Enjoy. Also, they pair very well with Hungry Happy. <laughs> Oh my god. Here's my favorite tequila. Whiskey. Jesus. Make them prove he's in Spain by sending you a bunch of goodies like... I, I, I'm not gonna make people send me... You have to prove it by sending me things. That would be terrible. No one wants that. Also, my lips are still super dry from Denver, which is not... It has not been fun. You're the dry lip boy? Yeah. Desert's no joke. Um, Rocky Mountain High... Actually, I'll take one of these guys. That was a pretty slow matchup. Colorado. A rocky mountain high. Colorado. Altitude lips. Yeah, that's that's what they call me. That's old altitude lips. This hand seems great. I will keep it. I just hired this guy to poison. Good talk, good talk. I don't know what you're doing. I'll take a photo of my next taco burrito and send it to Frank for sure. Please, so salty, that'd be awesome. Definitely do that. Oh. This is the child of the night. Whoa. If we go child of the night into Iron Shell Beetle putting a counter on it, can they even win? Probably not. Jeez, money bucks. We'll pour out it again with another for-profit gimmick. Send me gifts to prove you're not lying. Can you hear me underneath all those piles of gold to bloom, Scrooge McDuck? <laughs> oh, God. No. I can't hear you. The doubloons, they are too heavy. The doubloons. Does the tracks to proliferate the number of shots you take? I don't think so, but maybe. Every time we proliferate, Mike has to take a shot. Is that what you guys are saying? Oh, God. I'll be dead. One can only hope. Wow. Oh, that was dark, wasn't it? Let's see how much you want to block my guy. I just realized that by suffering, I'm supporting his alcoholism. I'm not going to be the one drinking. You're supporting Mike's alcoholism. Oh, this is a good trade. Let's make this trade all day. Wow. I traded your Boris Challenger for my Child of Night, and I gained three life. Deal. That was a good deal. That was a positive interaction. For I think you should attack with the Death Touch guy. I was thinking so, too. I think I yeah I think I should have attacked both times actually because I'm not gonna have anybody to block but or uh where we weren't gonna have anything to block is what I meant oh this is nice because now we can get oh okay ten doubloons <laughs> neon Tokyo rain you are good people my friend good people good doubloon people alright so we can't block this we're probably not blocking this guy so I'm just going to attack with this guy Mike do you like vodka I bought a superb one in Poland I do like some vodka oh Charlie Gag what did you say let's find out I sent you a whisper I don't see it though do I have to refresh twitch whispers are, are, are less than ideal oh I see you want to get in there with this guy now okay
Yeah, this is just getting blocked. Oh. Oh, Josh. It was to Josh. Okay, well. Let's see, this is this is hard. I guess that's why I don't see it then. I wish I had a way to officially get rid of this, but I do not. Maybe it's just Child of Night Burglar right here. Actually, it's probably Fine Broker. Because we can block this guy pretty easily with a Fine Broker. What do we get back, though? Probably mm. Child of Night. I kind of like Bister Guide, because let's play a land next turn. And we already have a Child of Night. And we can play any of the two drops. Excuse me, I believe it's actually Gold Blooms. Oh my god. This is now a Bloom stream. Not all Twitch DMs are for you. I don't believe you. I think that's pretty false. Okay, so you just had to call out the culprit. That's nice. I'm proud of you. We're all very, very proud of you. Probably going to block here. Because it adds to our... So this guy only costs six now, which is very reasonable. We'll probably cost like four next turn. Oh, that's a good draw, my, my biscuits. That's a good draw, my biscuits. <laughs> that's a good I think draw. I burglar right here, right? Burglar at Assassin's Trophy? Mm-hmm. Don't have two cards I kind of want to hit a land drop. Uh, true. Whatever. Yeah, this is a situation where they're not blocking. And this guy's... It's gonna be huge. Remember that? How could I forget? It's still a thing. Uh, yeah, I guess that's true. Happens every day. Every day. Remember when Debloom Titan was a huge deal in modern? <laughs> yeah, that was a good one. Old uh, Primeval Debloom Titan, a classic. They have one card in hand. I'm just going to block in trophy. So we have, what, four creatures in our graveyard now? So this guy costs five mana. If we hit a land, we can do it. Oh, they didn't play anything? Oh, boy, we're doing so well right now. Get a land and dead weight. Yeah, that's what we're doing. I'm pretty sure they can't win if we do that. Second half of the bottle kapow. All right, so 30, 32 bones, is that right? All right, we did it. Tequila online. Deploying threats and casting spells is my middle name. One, two, three, four. So this guy costs nine, so it's five mana. You can just play six, six next turn. So hey, chat. What is the best sodi pop to mix with tequila? Oh, God. And they're going to make fun of you and be like, don't mix soda with tequila, you nerd. You got I it. I mean, I'll do some straight as well because I want to taste it. Taste the flavor. Taste the flavor. <laughs> That's from Skittles. That's from Skittles. <laughs> <laughs> don't mix. None. Oh, no clue. Whiskey. Yeah, not soda. Yeah, see, like, no one... You just want, like, you're like a... You need these kid flavors. You're like, what? I what do alcohol taste like ice cream? I'm surprised you don't like the like the flavored vodkas. Like uh, I do like the flavored. Oh vodka. <laughs> the Mike Arnold. Thank you so much for 20 months in a row. That's insane. Really appreciate it, buddy. Thank you so much. Mix it with orange juice. I don't know if that's a troll or not. Is that a thing? Orange juice and tequila. You're a thing. Lime juice and orange citrus over ice. Did you try to put the lime in the coconut? Uncarbonated lime juice. That's interesting. That just sounds like a weird thing. No, lime and tequila makes sense. Really? But how much? It's very concentrated. 
mix it with a whole banana. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's... So if we give Menace here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, they have to block here or else they die. So let's do that. Tequila, orange juice, and grenadine. Hmm. If you block here, you take 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So you literally have to block this guy and lose two dudes. Mike, it's called a screwdriver. Orange soda and tequila. Interesting. I thought a screwdriver was with orange juice and vodka. But I guess maybe you can just use any alcohol? Why would you block like this and just die? I don't understand these decisions. Oh, okay. Ooh, mix it with squirt. I'm a big fan of squirt. That's a real funny thing to say. <laughs> I'm a big fan of squirt. <laughs> I can't even like. I can't even listen to you right now. I can't even handle this. Oh god. Can you use audible to cotton candy vodka? Is that a thing? He probably would love it. No, you have to give it awkward names if it's not vodka, like rusty screwdriver or dirty screwdriver. That's. That's probably true. I guess I could just get some grenadine and orange juice. Seems like a lot of effort, though. I'll probably just get orange juice and call it a, a dirty sunrise. Wait, or what's whatever. the effort there? It seems like they'd both be available at the alcohol place. Yeah, but they're going to cost so much. That's not effort, that's money. Oh, fair. That's literally the exact opposite. Then again, I am getting the tequila for free, so. Right, you've literally spent nothing. <laughs> it's like, I don't understand. I don't know, guys. You bought me free $30 to $5 tequila. I'm really reluctant to spend 3 bucks on grenadine. I think I'll just get squirt, because that sounds really good, actually. Well, you can get more than one thing. They don't just, uh... They don't limit you to one item. They do, actually. They don't. Well, that's why we have to we have to pay separately, so... Oh, that's awkward. Yeah, I'll get the alcohol. You can get the one, the one extra item. Because they force you to do that. That's a real weird... That's so they keep people from buying too much... Yeah, as a alcohol. business in a capitalist society, I get really mad when people buy too many of my products. <laughs> Please, buy less, buy fewer products. The old squirt and screwdriver. Oh, Sunny D? Wow. That's interesting. I can't tell who's trolling you and who's actually making suggestions. That's really... Ginger ale would make sense, too. Is it because they're both, like, dirty brown? Oh, this is great. I can Is it because they're both like dirty brown? You heard me. In response, I will radical idea. <laughs> My opponent's name is It's Lard Tube. <laughs> okay. So, you know, have fun with that one. I guess you're shooting me in the face in Elk Tears because I'm definitely going to mix it. I'm not just going to drink it straight all night. Or cough syrup. That's okay, well, that's. That's called Dirty Sprite. Well, that's a whole other thing. I think you're called Dirty Sprite. There are a lot of creatures with death. There's at least three Golgari creatures with death touch in this format. Wait, there's a tequila drink with orange juice and grenadine? Yeah, it's Tequila Sunrise. That sounds really sweet. Hey, do you remember um, when Lil Boofy went to prison and uh, that's where he first met Dirty Sprite? <laughs> I mean, that's where he first started drinking Dirty Sprite. No, that was his friend, Dirty Sprite. Do you think... Is he named after the drink? The drink was named after him, dude. Oh, snap. <laughs> <laughs> it's another Mike B sunrise. Booting do scooting do 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 do. I just, I just think able to get an overdraft fee out of two given to me refunded and it was clearly reason. Yeah, um, they don't like to give you back overdraft fees. <laughs> I the 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 strategy I implore is not spending money I don't have. That's my trick. Yeah, that's also my trick as well. As it turns out. Really? Yeah, I haven't overdrafted in a while, man. That's good. I make decent money now, so. I wish I could actually... Oh, man, if I had one man... Oh, actually, we can... This me, is nice. Me saying that with, like, $50 in my account. But, <laughs> you know, hey, I'm not overdrafting anymore. I guess that's fair. And all my bills are paid, so, you know. I 
could also just play Fine Broker here. Let's get back a dead weight. Boop! What up, Denmark? Long time no see, buddy. This is Tequila Sunrise. Alright, let's find it. Are you going to counter this? Oh, you're going to bounce your own guy? That does look delicious. Sure. <clears throat> that does look delicious. I would drink that. And then I'd be like, mm, no tequila, please. Because that's the worst tasting part of the drink. You can barely taste tequila on those bad boys, I bet. I'll taste it. One fiscal responsibility book. That <laughs> 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 uh, should not have been as Amazing. funny as it was. And yet it was. Are we getting drunk Mike today? Well, t later tonight we're going to do a commander stream. Tonight there's going to be a drunk Mike. That's good. Somewhere. Somewhere in the town. Yep, there you go. <laughs> and look how many death touches you got, man. I know, I literally win? just had a whole, I had a whole rant about how many death touches are in this set. Also, if you guys want to win a free pair of MeUndies, which you can get in the in the description below, uh, it's MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. You get 15% off your first order and free returns and free shipping, so you don't have to worry about those those pesky things. And they're some of the most comfortable underwear you, were ever, you will ever try. I can attest to it because there's some sitting on my desk. They're clean. But if you guys want to win a free pair, uh, you can enter by uh, Command GA in the chat, and it will enter you. I'm going to enter. And I will give you some. You actually could. And I will give you some. Uh, I'll, I'll give you some. And I'll give you some. I'll announce the winner at the end of this stream today. So. I will send you a, a form if you win. And. Uh, there you go. Crushing Canopy is insane when maximum altitude's in their graveyard. I just feel like I'm just. Wow. That was me. Mike. <laughs> Mike just played my the stream on his phone and the inception was real. Oh, now everybody's joining. Tonight there's gonna be an underwear break. They just spent five minutes to kill a 2 2. I'm alright with that. Can we sign the underwear for them? You can sign anything if you believe. I'm not sure if I'll send it to I don't know. I'm not sure if I can send it to Europe, but if you just enter anyway, right? Like, it doesn't hurt. I'm just going to crush and canopy this idiot, and then I'm going to attack 4, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then you still have to block this guy next turn if you can't kill it. Wake up, sheeple. Frank is still in dirty underwear and a racist Irish accent. What is. That? <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Do you want to buy me undies? Wake up, sheeple. He's right. I didn't want to. I didn't want to say anything, but that's true. Our deck is pretty good, I think. That's my feeling on the matter. Good talk. Good talk. I was reading the chat. Oh, what's happened? Anything good? <coughs> Did you hear Mike dying? It's it's real sad. Have Mike read my last comment. All right, hold on. Why do <laughs> if we're talking about cocktails and especially tequila scenarios, get Mike a 32 ounce cup and fill it halfway with ice. Four and two shots of tequila and two four and two shots of tequila and two shots of vodka. Fill with orange juice, a splash of granny. It's a tequila scenarios and a vodka screw are mixed together, or as I like to call it, screw the sunrise. Wow. Wow. This hand is great. <clears throat> kind of. I think I just get excited about all my my powerful cards, even though if they don't have a lot of synergy together. If you guys still had any of the Coke and coffee, whiskey would probably be really good with that. The Coke and coffee? Mm, I don't know about that. No, that's it. All right. We did it. Oh, I mean two and two. There you go. There you go. Oh, that was so good. Did you see it? Did you see us draw this card? I saw it. Would you say you seen it? Check the YouTube link I just sent a few moments. Oh my god, you guys are just literally telling me to check things. This is amazing. Tequila plus squirt plus lime. Oh, you just linked me to the very end of the video? <laughs> I'll keep it up, though, and we can watch it later. 
We'll forget. You'll forget. All right, is this round three already? No, this is round two, game two, right? Sure. I'm just bashing into this Whiskey game. and coffee is a thing? I've never heard of that. I'm not above trying it, though. You should try a virgin Coke and rum? How do I even do that? Is that just a Coke? <laughs> <laughs> I think what you're referring to is, is just Coke. We only have the Red Bull left. Yeah, we got a two for one, but this is this guy is one of their better threats. And I think that's just going to taste like Red Bull, though, right? I think you're going to shut up. Never. Because of Nickelback. I think you're going to shut up because of Nickelback. You heard me. I did. I just don't really know. You know. What it means. You do. Tonight there's going to be a Mike B. <laughs> I think it's just dead weight here. This card scares me, but I don't know if I care about it. It's one of those cards where I'm like, eh, I feel like I should be afraid of you, but I'm not really. Until it murders your whole family. Yeah. I guess you're right. I guess that would reinstill the fear in me. It does have trample, too. What do you play as a six mana spell, man? Oh, he didn't. Yeah, this is. It's not good. See you later, little nerd. Got a 1-1 one, one right here, boy. This guy's just hard to get past. Assassin's Trophy would be nice. We didn't get any, like, the... Uh, we didn't get any Price of Fame or any Deadly... Whatever it's called. I'm eating any food with my hands and procrastinating. All right, well, those are things you can do. All right, there's a lot of lands. I'm satisfied with my land count. This is, what, eight? All right, well... Hands Oberlander, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Are you supposed to eat Indian food with your hands? Because that seems that seems messy. I mean, it is a cuisine that's that's made to that is meant to be eaten with hands. Yeah. Hmm. I think I'll stick to utensils. Well, not all cultures are American, buddy. You're right. I'll use chopsticks. Okay. You're welcome to do so. Tonight there's gonna to be a jailbreak. I'll use two spoons as chopsticks. Can you can you can you play the spoons afterwards with those two spoons? Yeah. Our opponent has three cards in hand. Four, five, six, seven. We have nine. Nine lands, five cards is what we've drawn this game. Everybody's use a non. Yeah, non is a utensil. That's true. I should have got a fork with my takeout, but I feel really clutter cultured, but I <laughs> that's yeah. Whatever, Daddy Warbucks. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Oh This is suspicious. Yeah, this is okay, I'll I'll bite. You gonna sure strike me? No. Oh, really? This is This is just the kind of two for one you're living? Don't you know I want creatures in my graveyard? Fine, broker. Okra assassin. Five, six, seven, huh? I'm just gonna actually play this. Because I want them to be able to... It feels like they have a disdainful stroke. And I kind of want to... Force them to either block here or attack into it. Either one is fine. My hands are rice shovels, aren't 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 they all? All hands are rice sh rice shovels, if you believe. Oh, I see. So it gets like plus one, plus one. Seems good. I'll take two. <laughs> this seems so bad. It's a two nine. You got it. 
all that to deal two damage. Well, now it doesn't have to block, is really, I think, what they were trying to do, but it still seems funny. Alrighty then. Well, I guess we'll just play. This guy's only a 2 2, so we're still gonna. We need like a million more than this, right? Two more. This is what they're gonna disdainful stroke. It's lard tube. It's a weird name. It's just a tube of lard. Makes sense. Aren't we all? If I meet you in person, I'll introduce myself as rice shovels. That's a good idea. Oh, look, they had it. To the surprise of no one. We do have two more fine brokers in our deck, so that's nice. This guy's a 3-3 now, which is very reasonable. And our opponent has one card in hand. It's pretty okay. Yeah, but so do we. Right, but we also have, uh... We have a better deck, so... We got him. Eight toughness is too many. Not when I have Death Touch. Death Touch, I only need one power. One toughness is all you need. I'll hit you in the one toughness, buddy. What if we just put some of this, uh, like the like the the water enhancers in the in the tequila? That would be interesting. It'd be good though, right? We could do that. I don't know if it'd be good. It'd be good. <laughs> Look how many assassins. We have two assassins on board. This is the most assassins that, that anyone has ever had in the history of Magic the Gathering. Oh, you have one card in hand? Phenomenal. <laughs> okay, you got it. <laughs> this is all very funny. And we have Assassin's Trophy. Oh my god, it really is Assassin Tribal. <laughs> wow. Alright, well now I'm going to play this again. Let's get in there with this guy. I'll trade with either. Deal. Oh, they left a card on top. Fascinating. Fascinating. Well, this is a good one. I figured it was a removal spell of some sort, so... I'll take three. This guy's a 5-5 five five now? That's pretty sweet. How about this guy into Fine Broker? That'd be sweet. Oh, that's pretty good, I guess. One, two, three, four... We only have four in the graveyard. Okay. But excuse me? Oh, a little 70 here. One, two, three, four. So you could play this and it would deal four. No, it would actually deal three, right? Because it doesn't count itself. Oh my god, there's two two baby horses now? I can't even. So they're in top deck mode, and we have a 5-5, five, five, a 1-1, one, one, a 2-2. Two, two. Seems pretty good. Come at me, bro. What? I'm confused. Is he attacking with a 0-8? Yeah. That's... I'll take it. No blogs. Okay. They decided against it. Okay, well, glad you did. You didn't want to send a message. I wouldn't even cast it. Really? I want to get five extra damage in. He's. Mm. I don't think they're gonna have a better target than this. Well, if they never have a better target than that, you're probably winning the game anyway. Yeah. 
Sonic Assault, tap that guy down, sure. Oh, I guess they could have went Sonic Assault, tap this guy down, attack for, like, we would have blocked and... Sure. Whatever, man. <clears throat> Still don't have four, and, like, we go, whatever you draw, you'd have to play, like... These assassins seem to be veiled in a sandstorm. Oh, that would have been a good draw. Into that. Into Yeah, I'll take all that. That's fine. It's all good. Our deck is good. And we should feel good. Our deck makes me feel good. I'm going to put in Pax Favor instead of Crushing Canopy. I think it's probably better, especially with the uh, Okran Assassin. Our deck makes me feel good. Firo, thanks for the raid, buddy. Really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. <laughs> Those Pikachus are on point. Uh, yeah, this seems great. Any land gets us our, uh, our other land for the fine broker. That's all I really want in this world is... I just want to be fine... You okay? Tell me what you want. I feel like you're exploding over there. Tell Are you slowly exploding? Maybe. That's unfortunate. You should really... Uh... Look at this absurd deck I drafted yesterday. Alright, I'm going to take a look. I'm going to take a look. Okay, that's not reasonable. Two new mizzes, eh? Three hypotheses. And a murmuring mystic. Watching the mist. I hope you won this draft. Yeah, that deck looks insane. And I hope it wasn't close. I like your quote-unquote screenshot. That's pretty funny. Yeah, I, I would I would love to be there when when someone kills you to miss it and then you just play another one. I would just be like, okay. Oh, look at this guy. You know what happens to this guy? Death. Would you say he's got a lot of dead weight? I would say he's carrying around a lot of dead weight. Land. Alright, well, that's not a land. I guess I'm grateful that I could play it, but... Not really. Because now they're going to dead weight this guy, and it's going to be a real mirror match. You ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, that was... That still doesn't do anything. All right, that's really all I want. Oh, they missed the land drop? Uh, yeah, we're doing. This is how you win the game. Are you ready to win the game? Boy, oh boy. Oh boy, huh? I don't know, that's a, that's a jam I just wrote. It was pretty jammy. Yeah, well, you know, I do what I can, man. I do what I can. I feel like we're way ahead right now. And uh, it's not particularly close. Because that's how way ahead works, I guess. So you don't really have to say it's not particularly close. If you say you're way ahead, because they're kind of the same. One, <laughs> One giveaway. Am I doing this right? I think you nailed it. I think that's yeah, that's basically I think you just I think you just perfected it. It's you're actually I think you broke it. Walmart or Target? Um Walmart for convenience, Target for preference. All right, you're attacking with a 3-2. I have a 3-4. What can you have? It doesn't matter. I'm just going to trade. My 3-4 on board is much better than my 1-1, one, one, which trades with this guy. They're probably just like, oh, you have a dead weight, so I might as well get some value out of this. But but there won't. There, there's no value to be had. There's no value to be had. I don't know what that voice was. It was very weird. 
Uh, I don't know either. Okay, you're doing good. I'm very proud of you. I'm not that proud of him. Is the honest thing a small step toward the t-shirt thing? Uh, the honest thing is actually a sponsorship from a company called MeUndies. And they're very comfortable micromodal underwear, uh, tees, lounge pants, and socks. So you guys can check those out in the link below. MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. Or alternatively... I don't know what else you could do, I guess. I see you're a votey boy. A votey boy? Yeah. I gotta submit my my mail in ballot. It's much better than actually going to the polls. Who wants to do that? Who's got the time, man? I think they're dead. So uh Micromodal? A Google Micromodal. It's a it's a type of fabric. And it's extremely soft it's as soft as eggs it's if you had an egg that was really soft it's about that soft yeah i i agree with that i don't think we changed anything because we just crushed so hard mm -hmm. i can see putting the spinal centipede in for the imp but i'll do it but it's a thought tease bro Josh, I, or uh, Matthew, I agree with you completely. Agree with you completely. I will keep. My nose is itching. If a lazy SOB like me can vote, you can vote too. That's 100% true. Mike was like, hey, I voted. And I was like, oh my god. I was surprised. Because it seems like something you wouldn't really care about, but I was impressed. I actually deeply care about it. I think you should. I think you're. I think that's the right way to be, my friend. What is this? I feel like once our Golgari opponent... When when we, when we see the quality of our deck, once our Golgari opponent plays Barrier Bones, I'm like... What does Barrier Bones even do? Exactly. You Surveil. It's an 0-3 defender, and it Surveils 1. That does not seem particularly great. It does not. It does not. Plus, I just get to eat it with my Okrin Assassin. Are national center races decided by straight popular vote or by districts? Uh, I don't think that's a, that's a dumb question. I actually don't really answer that. I don't either, actually, and I feel bad about that. Okran makes me feel good. Yeah, that's fine. I got a dead weight for that. Yeah, I, I think Vine, I like the idea of Vine because it, it, it draws you a card, it blocks some things early, and then it gets in the graveyard for undergrowth, and I think that's fine. Um, the problem is that it just doesn't seem good in practice. Okay, so that's a two for one. That seems fine. I would like to draw a forest here just so I can play Fine Broker or... District Guide Deadweight, because I would... Okay. I guess we could still go District Guide, get a Forest, play the Swamp, and then Deadweight. Yeah, I think we're doing that. Killing you, because you're just a better creature. And they have two cards in hand? Oh my god, our hand... We have double Fine Broker and a... Mulder Hulk and they have two cards in hand. <sighs> yep, well, one hundred percent trade. This guy already got us a an extra card. Don't be Doom Whisper, I guess. Three drop, two drop, one drop. All right. Well, I guess your deck makes more sense now. It still doesn't seem great though. Like, you got this guy, which does nothing. We're going to find Broker and kill this guy again. Yeah, I don't need you to be surveilling every day. Every day. Pretty sure this is a 3-0, but... How have you been liking the format? I've actually been liking it a lot. It feels like there's a lot of... Uh, it doesn't feel like anything's too strong. 
it okay sure <laughs> um it doesn't feel like it feels like all of the the guilds are pretty balanced like you could win with any guild i feel like as long as your deck is as long as you're picking up the right signals so it, it kind of rewards some discipline in your drafting um, one, two, three, four. <clears throat> one, two, three, seven, eight, nine, it's a six. We can actually just play this guy if we wanted to. Seems I don't see decent. why. Well, I'd rather just play this and get the fine burger back, right? Get it on the next turn. That is true. Actually, just gonna put the counter on itself here. I think you can also. I, I I think Celestia is probably one of the worst guilds, but I still think it's good enough to win. Like I've definitely had great Celestia decks where you can win. Sure. <laughs> this is just actually great for us. I'll take another two. You have one card in hand. I don't know how you beat looping three fours. So one, two, three, four. This guy costs five. I definitely don't think Golgari is the worst. Golgari is probably one of my favorites, in fact. This guy costs five, so we can't do anything else but play this guy. Still think that's good. I just rather have fine brokers out. Like I just like we don't have to play something like these. Just get us a card every single turn. Play a land. Actually, maybe I should have held the land. I think I should have because if they draw like a burglar rat or something, I'd rather be able to discard a land and get it back with Mulder Hulk. I mean, if you're spending a statute every turn to kill a Golgari Fine Broker, like, eh, probably not going to be. I guess the other reason is uh, if we draw one more Swamp, we can play both in a turn. Or this and this. Resif, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. I'm so bummed. I've been so busy at work. I haven't been able to watch the stream and therefore missed that you were going to GP Denver where I could have met you. Resif, oh, not good, buddy. Not good. Although being busy at work is probably, probably okay, right? So now this guy costs six, I believe. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Good talk. Thanks. You're welcome. This is where they kill this. You know, like, I'll I'll deadly visit a Oh, that's good. That's a good dude. That's a big boy. That is a big boy. He's a big boy. And a hana ha hana. And a hana ha hana. Yeah. You can rely on the big boy's money. He's a big boy. This is actually fine. If you want to pay for every single turn to do this, like, this is just great. So wouldn't it have just been better to take three? Oh, no, because then I have to do this, I guess. But, like, you know I have it. So I don't understand the... You can rely on the big boy's money. The big boy. What were the comments on the Tiny Frank on the YouTube? Oh, uh, they were actually pretty good. People thought it was pretty funny. Tiny Frank, what? Oh, you didn't know about that? No. I don't know what the uh, 
don't know which video it was. Anyway, it was a recent one. That was, was it that clip, maybe? Okay, well. <laughs> it was like that for the whole draft. It was pretty good. Wow. Was that on purpose? Yeah. Well, how would I, how would I accidentally do that? I don't know. Software is weird, man. Oh, my God. Now I can just... They're probably like, oh, he just played the second one. <laughs> Was it 6, 79, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15? Not, actually, we can play... Oh, we can play this guy next turn and haste him out. Do they have anything to, like... Are they playing two of these? No, it's the same one. Okay. You know what? Sure. If you want to double block here, I'll just kill this guy. Oh. Alright, that's fine too. Yeah, people just keep cast passing fine brokers, so I'm just fine taking them. I hope the pros keep saying that Golgari is bad because I'll just keep taking all your good Golgari cards. They have two cards in hand. We have triple fine broker loops. You can rely on the Mike B's money. He's a Mike B. And he gone too far because you know he don't Mike B anyway. Alan Beck with 33 runs in a row. Look at all these months. I can't even hold them all. I can't even hold all these months. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Wait, aren't you a magic pro? Yes. But I don't have any I don't have any opinion on uh on the best tribes and guilds. Tribes and guilds and tribes and guilds. Tribes and guilds and tribes and guilds. Alright, so you just die here? So you just die. Are you dead yet? I mean, he's at 16. I don't think he's just dead, but... Uh, 6, 79, 10, 11, 12, 13, 20, 15, 16, 17. He's probably going to block. He blocks... All of them have to block this. Oh. So they block here. And then they take 17. So if you literally don't have an answer for this card, you're dead. You're dead. Okay, so you didn't take either of those. You can rely on Mike B's money. He's a rich Mike. And he's gone too far. I guess we just play this guy. We're at 13. We're not in any risk of dying here, but... Even if they kill this, we're doing a lot of damage. Yep, let's see what happens here. Frogler, two months in a row. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Starter of Eldrazi. I wouldn't say I started it. I, I was definitely a participant in it. Eldrazi Winter was a hell of a drug. It was a pretty small winter, though. Okay, they're both blocking this guy. I don't think you can pay four. If you kill this guy, you take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven... Uh, I'll actually kill the guy that I can definitely kill. So I assume you have to kill this with like... Oh, you're just dead. Alright, that was fascinating. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Check me out on Twitch and Patreon. You can find the links in the description below. Uh, watch If you're watching on YouTube, which I'm ending the video for now, I'm not leaving Twitch. You can... Uh, also, check out MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore if you want 15% off your first order. Super soft, super sweet, and uh, you get free shipping and free returns, so that should help you out there as well. And slam those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for everything. Really appreciate it. I'll see you next time, which is what I just said, I think. So, thanks for watching.